Hi, welcome to the first episode of a new series of videos documenting development of a new Nixie tube. My name is Dalibor and for the past 12 years I was trying to resurrect production of Nixie tubes that were at some point obsolete and no longer manufactured. Today I run a small business, employ a few people and together we make Nixie tubes and produce Nixie clocks and sell them mostly online on our website. The name of the new Nixie tube will be F, where the F stands for forever. And the goal will be to develop Nixie tube so good that it has a chance to survive in the production forever. There is no exact shape or look of the Nixie tube yet. This is about to be developed in the videos. Uh, so right now it's in a phase of an idea, but there are some aspects that I already know. As for the size of the Nixie tube, it will be slightly smaller than our current R tube. So the current digits are 50 millimeters tall, it will go to roughly the same size. The diameter of the tube will be slightly smaller. So instead of 50 millimeters, it will be 40 millimeters. Uh, another difference will be that we will switch from the pinched stem to a full glass pressed stem. So there will be no metal ring around the bottom of the tube. This will further improve the efficiency of manufacturing of the Nixie tube. And another important factor will be that, will be that we will try to continually uh, improve the efficiency of the production and reflect these improvements into the price. So we will try to get, we will try to preserve some healthy margin on the tube, but improve the production so that we can decrease the price. At the beginning, we like the first goal is to fight the inflation and then the next goal will be to decrease the price. I know that the price is important factor of how many Nixie tubes we can sell and how big will be the production. And it's very important for us to reach higher numbers so that we can be more efficient. At the moment, we produce roughly 2000 Nixie tubes per year and in the future we would like to make 20,000, so 10 times the numbers that we do right now. It's a very high risk project. It's also uh, quite low chance that we will succeed. So this is what I know at the beginning already, but uh, I'm going to start and we'll see, we'll see what will happen. Because why it is risky? We will need to start building machines for the production that we don't have and uh, that cannot be purchased. So quite a lot of time and effort in development. The current Nixie tube, the R, will stay in the production. We want to keep it in the manufacturing, but it will be produced in lower quantity. And the time that we save this way, we want to devote to the F tube. I will talk more about this in detail in the review of the 2023 that I want to make in a month or so. Thank you for your attention and the next video will be already some building, not just talking. See you.